Good morning, my dear students. Hope everyone is fine. Today, our lesson will be about the present simple and the present continuous. How to differentiate between them? So we will start. We um, we will revise both of them, and then we will answer the exercises in the booklet. So let's start. The present simple versus the present continuous. The usage. When do we use them? We use the present simple as it's shown in front of you when we talk about daily routines, habits, or scientific facts. The other one, the present continuous, we use it when we talk about actions in progress, something is happening now, at the moment. So here, the key words, of course. So the key words that let us know if the sentence is in the present simple or the present continuous, the present simple keywords are always, never, usually, sometimes, often, every day, at night, in the afternoon, in the morning, in the evening, all the time. The present continuous tense, the keywords are now, right now, at this moment, nowadays, look, listen, and add the present. So here we will move to the form. How do, you, how do we form the present simple? Of course, you know that we have affirmative sentences, negative sentences, and interrogative, which is the question. Let's move to the first one, the affirmative, the normal sentence. I, you, I put S, E, S, or I, E, S with he, she, or it. And I, we, they. You, we leave the verb in the infinitive form. Like the, the, the example, we have I live, you live, he lives, she lives, it lives, and so on. The negative form, which is not. I, in the negative form, I use doesn't or don't. Doesn't, it, that has S, I use it with he, she, and it, as it's shown in front of you. I don't live. You don't live, he doesn't live, she doesn't live, it doesn't live, and so on. So we put don't and doesn't plus the verb in the infinitive form. Okay? Let's move to the last one, the interrogative or the question. So in the interrogative, I ask the question with do or does. I start the sentence with do or does. And after do or does, the subject, he, she, they, you, and the verb in the infinitive, like the examples. Do you live? Does he live? Does she live? Do we live? And so on. Let's move to the present continuous form. How do we form the present continuous? You know, of course, that we form the present continuous verb to be plus verb ing. Excellent. So verb to be, it means am, is, or are plus verb ing. So I have here the positive form or the, the affirmative, the negative in the question. So the positive I am starting, verb to be plus ing. You are starting, he is starting, and so on. Okay, the negative form, I use not. I use not after verb to be. So I am not, you are not, he is not, she is not starting. Okay, you can write it. Uh, are not or aren't. Are not is the long form, aren't is the short form. Also, if you put isn't, this is the short form, and you can write it is not. It's also okay. But am not, it will be am not. Is it clear? Okay, let's move to the question, the last one. How do I form the question in the, uh, in the present continuous? I start the sentence with is or are plus subject plus the verb ing, like the example. Are you starting? Is he starting? Is she starting? Are you starting? And so on. Let's move to the exercises. I hope you understood what I said, and now we will move to the exercises to do more practice. So number one, uh, before, 
Answering, I will ask you please to open together page 49, booklet one. You will have the first exercise, correct the verbs between brackets. Number one, Miriam between brackets, skip the rope now. So number one, I must underline, where is the keyword now? Present, continuous, excellent. So it will be verb to be plus I and G. So Miriam, it means she. So she is skipping. I will double the P. Why? Can you tell me why? Because it ends with a consonant letter. Before the consonant, there is a vowel. And before the vowel, a consonant, C, V, C. Don't forget, if I have C, V, C, so I must double the last letter. Let's move to number two. They always sit on this bench. Where's the keyword always? Super present simple. So how do I form the verbs with they in the present simple? The verb will be as it is. So sit, it will be sit in the infinitive. Excellent. Let's move to number three. I run 100 meter at the moment. Present continuous, super. So I will correct run in the present continuous. I am running and I will double the N. Number four, George and Joan clap their hands now. Where's the keyword now? Present continuous. Good job, everyone. So clap, it will be George and Joan. They, they are. Excellent, they are clapping and I will double the P. What about number five? Shahira visit her grandfather on Fridays. On Fridays, present simple. Excellent, so visit, it will be visits. I will put S because Shahira it means she so she she he she and it they love S E S I E S okay so let's move to exercise B of course the rest of the exercise from number six to number ten I will leave it for you to do it as a homework so now let's move to exercise B together Exercise B, change into negative and interrogative. The first one, Danny is watching TV now. So now, present continuous. So here I will do the negative form in the present continuous. Danny is not excellent watching TV now okay so number the second one interrogative interrogative means question so i will start with is i will do the cross okay so is danny watching t v now, and don't forget to put the question mark, it's the most important thing. Number two, she goes to bed early. Here, we have ES in the verb, so it's present simple, it's not present continuous. So, what is the negative form in the present simple? I do it with don't and doesn't. So, here I will look at the subject, she, she, so she, it will take doesn't, she doesn't. And the verb will be in the infinitive form. They doesn't go. Okay, only go to bed early. And don't forget the full stop. The second one, the interrogative, which is the question form. So I ask the question with do or does. So of course here I will start it with does. Does she go to bed? early and don't forget the question mark let's move to the next or the opposite page number three i have wait a minute number three
it is raining at the moment. So in the negative form, it will be it is not raining at the moment. The second one, the negative form, I will do the cross. Okay, so I will let verb to be to be, uh, to come at the beginning of the sentence. Is it raining at the moment? And I will put the question mark. I am writing with my pen. So I will do the negative form first. It will be I am not. Writing with my pen. The second one, the interrogative, the question form. So I will do it like that. Am, it will be are. Why? Because I cannot ask myself. So it will be are you, I, it will be you. Are you writing? And I will change my to your. Are you writing with your pen? And don't forget to put the question mark super. So here I finished the exercises. I will let uh, you to complete the rest. Okay, you will complete page 50 and 51 exercise B. And we will answer exercise C together. So let's move to the other page. Exercise C, complete the following dialogue with the present continuous or the present simple. Here, we will complete with both tenses. How do we know or how to differentiate between them? We will search for the key words. So number one, we have the presenter. Tonight, we space in between brackets, visit, Paradise food restaurant. So here I have tonight. It's one of the keyword of the present continuous. Let's remember together the keywords. Look, listen now, today, at the moment, at the present. Tonight it's like today. So present continuous. So tonight we are visiting. Excellent. We are visiting. Paradise food restaurant. It be very famous. Be here. It means verb to be. Am is or are. So it is excellent. It as it is very famous. This be the owner. This is the owner. Super. So it's a fact. This restaurant is very famous and this is the owner. So Mr. Brown, yes, our restaurant is famous because it always, I have here one of the keywords of the present simple. So I have it, it make, make it will be makes. I will add S super to the regular verbs. So it makes tasty food. We open every day at 6.30. So we, in the present simple, we will correct open with we. So it will be the same as it is because in the infinitive, because with they, we, do, uh, they, we, you, and I, I leave the verb in the infinitive form. So we open every day at 6.30 p.m. Come and meet our workers, the presenter. This is Harry. He is super. He is a waiter. He not served now. I have here the keyword of the present continuous. So he is asking you to do it in the negative form. So what is the negative form in the present continuous? Am not, is not, or are not, plus verb ing. So with he, it will be he is or he isn't serving. Excellent, he isn't serving now because he 
eat dinner because he is in the present continuous he is eating good job so let's move to the presenter space he always space eat dinner here and it's a question it means that i will correct the verbs in the question form so this sentence in the present simple so i ask or i make a question in the present simple with do or does let's look at the subject he so he takes do or does excellent so does he always eat the verb with does in the infinitive so does he always eat dinner here mr brown yes my workers eat dinner here every evening present simple so my workers plural they so eat so my workers eat dinner here every evening these are brian and fred they wash the dishes in the kitchen now i have now present continuous so wash it will be they are washing super okay so the presenter ladies and gentlemen you must come you must come and visit this restaurant i have finished hope you enjoyed the lesson uh, i will ask you to do your homework don't forget please to revise the present simple and the present continuous while watching to this videos and then answer or do your homework